Hey guys, today I'm going to take you along with a day in a life as someone who's lost over 60 pounds and still on his weight loss journey. Basically in this video, I'm going to show you literally my typical Sunday, no fluff, totally raw. And I'm going to explain why I do certain things that have helped me lose weight and give actual practical advice that you can implement. And what kind of sparked this video is that I see a lot of fluff and unrealistic things on social media. And keep in mind, this isn't a fully 100% guide, but sort of just a bag of tricks that I find useful and easy to do every single day. Okay, it's like 10 o'clock. Um, the first meal I usually like to have, very delicious. I'll show you exactly how. Okay, I just finished making it. Yeah, it's just two glasses of water. The first thing I like to do almost every day is intermittent fasting, which is basically when I have my first bite of food at 12 p.m., which is lunch. Now, obviously, some people like breakfast a lot, so this might not work for you, but I find that when I have my first meal at 12 p.m., my last bite at 8 p.m., I find that since my window of eating is much smaller, it reduces the amount of calories I eat, which prevents me from overeating. Also, when your body is in a fasted state, it starts targeting the fat in your body to use for energy. Thus, you know, it's extra fat burning. Oh, so I just got the Planet Fitness. Yes, I have a Planet Fitness membership. It's cheap. That's why I like it. So what I usually like to do is like try to roll out, stretch out, basically. Use a home roller to stretch. Feels pretty good too. So I'm thinking today we're gonna hit chest, chest and thighs. All right, so my working sets are like 60 pounds. So I usually just do like 10 pounds. Oh my God. My right AirPod has 10% battery. Are you serious? That's trash. I don't know if I can pump that hard today. Debuffed. Okay, that was like 50s, take a warm up, and I grab my working set. So one thing I would say is that some people don't like working out fasted. You don't work out fasted. You gotta eat in the morning before. You know, I'm trying to go to the gym at like 8 a.m., like two hours, I eat like breakfast at six. Okay, it's like 10 o'clock. If you go well fasted, there's 0% chance you're throwing up. That's called 200 IQ thinking. Now, I don't think there's necessarily a benefit to fasting while exercising. I just personally prefer this because if I don't have food in my stomach, I feel like I'm kind of quote unquote lighter. And it's kind of stupid, but I feel like when I don't have food in my body, I can push myself more and not feel the scared urge that I'm gonna throw up and throw up all the food I just ate. But it's also nice timing because you can just get your workout in quickly then go grab like food on the way home and you don't have to cook anything. Oh, this is a snipe. This is a snipe. One of the worst fears I have is someone just yoinking the camera. But it's like, good thing I'm like decently fast. And, like, if you yoink it in the gym, oh, well, I mean, they can take the doors right there. But like, you can't get away from me that easily though. I'll chase you to the end of the world. I uh, probably not. I'm tired. I don't know if I'll hit the last 12 reps. <sighs> Bro, if I'm doing this sentence, I'm steals my camera. I would have no idea. I'm looking at the ceiling. Damn. There's somehow no tricep ropes over there. That's actually crazy. They must have moved them all the way here. Someone's being a naughty, naughty boy. They're not over here either. That's crazy. And my left AirPod is now running. Now I have no, no music the rest of the workout. That's great. There's actually none in this whole entire building, which is crazy. Now I gotta use a machine. I've never used a machine before. And there's someone using the machine too. Well, gotta do shoulder press now. Oh, really? <laughs> Thank you. Third is actually 4K, but <laughs> I'll let it go. Now the problem I'm running into right now is that I am three-fourths. Man, don't waste this film, let's go, come on. <laughs> yeah, that guy's funny. I'm three-fourths of my uh, water through, and I have no more water in the Planet Fitness water. Dirty, dirty tap water. Dirty freaking tap water. So I need to, he's right, I'm wasting film. 
damn, I hurt my shoulder. What the hell? God damn. The final ball has entered the chat. Oh, this thing's funny. Yeah, who was doing this flash machine? Damn, I like these blue shorts I have on though. They're nice. <sighs> Freaking this machine, bro. <sighs> God damn. Okay, it's like almost 11 o'clock. Let's do this one and then one more thing. And then get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here. And go grocery shopping. Come well, on, which I do for my last one? Man, it's probably just on lot raises. Damn it. Yeah, I got your lot of raises done. That's a bro moment. Actually a bro moment. Yeah, I think I do a lot of raises. Damn. You know what? I shouldn't be complaining. I have the opportunity to do a lot of raises. Ah, damn. Hopefully I don't trigger the lunk alarm with these grunts. Oh, nice. You got a little, like, armrest. <sighs> One of these days, I have to trigger the lunk alarm. Hopefully my last day, I'll trigger the lunk alarm. Dude, that bee is freaking spazzing. That bee is just spazzing out, bro. Dude, I don't like doing lat raises. Partially because... I don't know if I'm doing them right. <sighs> bro, I think I spam these lat raises out so I can just leave, bro. I wanna, just wanna eat some food, man. Would you guys rather be able to eat infinite food and not get any calories from it? But you have to always eat or be able to like a plant like an autotroph only be able to eat via the sun like you don't need to eat food honestly i love food but imagine the time will save if i could just soak in the sun and just get free energy it's like a battery i'm a solar panel oh my god i gotta spam these bro right next to the trash can Okay, kind of veiny right now, kind of veiny right now. Damn, I'm kind of pumped right now. All right, I just finished my workout. Now comes the best time of the day, grocery shopping. Oh yeah, food is food, food is food. All right, it's like 11.15. See if I can do a little shopping vlog. Wait. No! Oh. 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 We are gonna be crooked for a little. Oh. Flip. Rip you guys. Rip. Alright. Pushing. Holding you guys with one hand. The problem is that there's readily available food here. Damn, that I kind of want to grab. Is a whole chicken breast? Sixteen dollars. No chocolates. Oh yeah, I just finished eating. I was gonna just cook some eggs and like potatoes, but parents were cooking um, the porridge. So I just ate that with some eggs, onions and stuff. Just like a lot of fruits, vegetables, but some dark chocolate. Gotta love that. But probably just gonna take a shower now. Bye. <laughs> okay, I just took a shower. Now I'm probably just gonna go on my phone for a little bit and then do some work on my computer. Now going out to eat is a very controversial topic because some people say you gotta stick on your diet, some people don't. I feel like I'm on that kind of boat where it's like, you know, I'm a big guy, or I used to be a big guy. I enjoy the food that I eat. So just giving out everything isn't really practical for me. So what I found useful is just keeping a balance, of course, and if you're gonna go out to eat, it's gonna be more calories, so you gotta make up for it earlier in the day by eating less, obviously. But just remember that there's gotta be some kind of sacrifice if you wanna lose weight, right? Another rule that I kinda of follow when I go out to eat is to actually eat high quality foods and food that I'm actually enjoying eating. Not just going out for a cheap meal like McDonald's, Chick-fil-A. They're just fast food. If you're gonna go out to eat, go to an actual restaurant with higher quality food that, you know, requires more than just like something that you can cook at home, you know? 
Lastly, don't stress out about it, you know? It's a marathon, keep going. Take one step back, two steps forward, you know? Yeah, later.